friends. Um, I don't think I've shared it here. Yeah, has been battling cancer for some time and I'm not crazy about this style. It's like a Western kind of cowboy. Black people do not wake up babies. We will miss an entire funeral before we wake up a baby. I mean, you are watching this right now, mark my words. Year from now, two years from now, like you all are going to look back on this and be like, wow. Like, I remember when she started this. Like, I. Thanks for me and being the new to a new weekly vlog. I am Jesse, your resident Francophile. Here on Cappuccinos and Consignment, I focus on lifestyle, travel, and finance. Follow me here. Subscribe over on Insta, the blog, all of that jazz. I'm trying to get better at saying that because I don't appreciate your support so much. It is Wednesday morning. I am a bit behind schedule. I am I'm heading out for my morning walk every day. The kids and I have a 14-year-old and a 10-month-old. We. <laughs> we we go know? for our walk. Come, huh, baby. You mean a 10-month-old? How, how old did I say she was? Um, I said 14. Oh, 14. My 14 year old is always telling me, <laughs> trying oh, to correct I me. I <laughs> my um, daily espresso video every morning over on Insta. I just record myself preparing a single shot of espresso, which is a must before I go for my walk. And um, yeah, over some dope tunes. So, but yeah, so this is pretty much what I wear for the walk. Really wanted to take it easy today. I posted a weekly vlog yesterday. Every Tuesday I post these. Upload a vlog. I kind of wind down because it takes so much, like the editing process and all. So I need to go because the 10-month-old, what was that? A wayward piece of fur, but I will check back in when I can. All righty. Ciao for now. me and happy Thursday. I don't think I have um, actually spoken today. I'm exhausted. It has been such a long day. I did an unboxing on the last vlog, my Apple Watch. I'm still trying to get the hang of it. I was going to return it solely because I thought I could not sync my Google Calendar. Like I am truly giving Apple iPhone a chance. A new Mezzanine, I have been like team Android forever, but since I use a MacBook, ecosystem of using an iPhone is so great with my computer. I cannot deny that. But um, with that, fully emerging myself in Apple and I am not loving the calendar. Like the calendar with Apple is just not great. If I wasn't able to get my calendar mirrored onto the watch that was going to be the determining factor as to whether I was going to return it or not. I didn't plan on vlogging this evening because I'm a really big project um, that I am presenting tomorrow. It's just been taking so much of my time. It's about I don't know seven o'clock or so. I decided to come up and record because two pairs of boots that I totally forgot I ordered. That's on the last vlog I shared how difficult it has been trying to find a pair of boots to match the pon poncho that I purchased on the vlog before last. You have to check all these out on um, the NYC vlog. So um, yeah, I'm gonna flip the camera. Let's just try it out. I'm just gonna throw it on over the dress that I'm wearing. Like I'm not truly styling it. I just wanna see how it looks. So let's do it. So this is the first pair. The dressing room is an absolute mess. I'm already, I don't know if I, I'm loving that little, I don't know, you see like this little piece. So let me know like in the comments what pair, I have two pairs so far. Let me know which pair you all prefer because I'll still be within like the return policy. Yeah, I think that's gonna bother me the way it keeps. I wanted something a bit more structured. Other than that, I do like these. They're comfortable, but I, I really feel like that's going to bother me. So let me grab the cake. Okay, so this is the full look. I feel like, I mean, it does match. I will say that that has been the concern is that trying to get like a good brown that goes with it. But yeah, that really bothers me. And like if I tuck it down, which I could that defeats the purpose of it being like an over the knee boot. I don't think this is forgivable. 
because I want an over the knee boot and that lack of structure and just the fact that I have like pretty skinny legs I can just envision after wearing these several times that it'll fall and that's just not flattering okay let me try the second pair on okay so this is the second boot I do love how structured this boot is like it is extremely structured it's not the style I'm not crazy about this style it's like a western kind of cowboy I, I don't like the high low <laughs> I have to put up my laundry I don't like the high low of the boot but to date this is like the best that I've been able to find I don't know why it has been such a challenge trying to find a boot okay so this is it i will wait until um you all chime in before i return the other pair although i'm not crazy about these i feel like i like these better than the others but again we'll wait to see what mess and me on youtube thinks see this is why i like ig because i can get like real time responses so like if i posted this on ig now i will get like all the feedback but i um i do i'm curious to know what you all will think and i have 30 days for both pair for a return so okay the call is a a big day tomorrow so ciao for now To me, I don't know if this is going to be a copyright issue. Baby Chain is watching, um, watching Coco Melon. Happy Saturday. I hope that you all have been well. I have not been active really on anything. Actually, let me not push this. I'm going to pause Coco Melon. Oh, I am in the loft. Like, as soon as I went over to attempt to hit pause on Coco Melon, the look she gave me, and I'm like, you know what? I don't have the energy today like you win so I gave her space like three levels of space I'm um, in the loft so I am about to pack up a posh order I sold um a fox not faux <laughs> fox f-o-x fur yesterday I believe and I want to hurry up and get this um shipped out before the post office closes at noon I also came up to the loft yeah more so because I need to print the label I haven't set the phone up to my um, printer, the wireless printer, so I, I hope it's not going to be a problem. At this point, I don't understand why post offices don't have the scan bar. Why do I have to print things out in this day and age? Like, it's so annoying. So let me go ahead and get this packed up so I can hurry up and get to the post office. Let me get this done and I will check back in at some point. All right. Child for now. I just thought about it. I don't know if you all have um, seen the loft. I've shown it a few times in other videos. It's like it's a mess. These are still like gifts and things that I haven't opened. Furs are back there. This is um, most of the pieces that I have listed for Posh. The loft is where I keep a lot of my vintage pieces or outerwear. And um, yeah, it's a mess up here. <laughs> I haven't gotten to straightening up everything. Oh, yeah. Okay, let me get to this printer. Chewing as a me. So I stayed home, um, did some things around the house. I actually came into the dressing room so that I can find um, what I'm going to wear tomorrow. I'm meeting my sister <laughs> and taking the kids to the zoo. But while I was here, I was looking for one of my blankets that I purchased when I um, lived in South Africa. But I realized that I needed to take my spring summer pieces up to the loft. So as pretty as these are dangling here, I think I'm gonna take those up as well. I'll see, but right now I'm starting with these. So yes, let's go up to the loft. Okay, so for the most part, like I wear my pieces year round, 
but there are of course some things that just cannot be and all of this like lace and all so let's see i'm gonna take this down i need to swap out the hanger i got this in new york i'm gonna really do this one day like do a full swap but right now i'm just taking a few pieces um, just wanted to check in. I look so crazy right now. I'm going to switch the camera. I'm so crazy right now because I have on this like faux leather dress saying if I could um, wear this tomorrow. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead, pack um, baby Chino like her diaper bag and all and solidify what I'm going to wear tomorrow. So I will see you all tomorrow. Ciao for now. Sure, Mezzanine. It is Sunday. I wanted to do a quick OOTD before I left because I have the tendency to not do so. I'm not doing a lip because um we're gonna have on a mask, but um voila. So we are actually running a bit behind, which works out well because it started raining and it's projected to stop raining um in about an hour or so, which will be perfect timing. And um, yeah, <laughs> baby Sheena was still asleep, and you all know, and if you don't know. Black people do not wake up babies. We will miss an entire funeral before we wake up a baby. I mean, truly, a sleeping it's... baby will have you reevaluating how close you were. <laughs> truly, like, I mean, we weren't that close. <laughs> not wake up a baby close. <laughs> okay, let me stop. Um, We are, yeah, let's head out. I will see you all at the zoo. Ciao for now. getting hit by a car it's, but, but it's him sorry i'm putting in an insurance claim you all know i'm petty <laughs> are you toasting so there's time there's tickets now they're not time you just buy them for the day and you come at whatever time during the day so that was that worked out well because had I had an actual time ticket, we would have been late. Should we go here or which way do you want to go first? Okay. Look how you do. I'm scared to get in front of you. Okay, so sister recommended that I get the apple, what is it? Um, apple macchiato. Are we going straight? Crisp macchiato. So good. I did an extra shot. Much needed. Cheers. Cheers. Hands up like a brown bear. Pushing the stroller and eating crackers at the same time. <laughs> Are, as Juju the camera kid will say done for the kid I would say kids are asleep why aren't you sleeping <laughs> why aren't you sleeping look at your teeth <laughs> look at like Jerobi Robi Rose the player from the Himalaya <laughs> oh my god Jerobi Robi Rose <laughs>
we are exhausted, but before we part ways, Sissa has something to say. Ciao for now. <laughs> <laughs> when we were in Boston, before I could even like close out, she's like, ciao for now. <laughs> and me and happy Monday. Oh, I am I'm in the dressing room. I'm on the floor. <laughs> if you um can't tell. I had to step away from what I was doing and just, you know, kind of bring it back all in and it's cliche as it may sound it's like being on the floor sometimes I notice does kind of literally ground me. <laughs> and so um I just I want to thank you all like a huge merci beaucoup last week. I received so many messages from like Numez and me who have joined me and it truly means so much to me like you all you really have no clue how much this means um I don't think I've shared it here but I have over on um Insta my mare has been battling cancer for some time and it's been a lot and so she was here last week which is why I really wasn't present why I wasn't vlogging because I really wanted to spend so much time with her and it's just amazing because all that she is going through she's like you need to record your mess and me want to see you you need to do this you need to do that and I'm like are you serious <laughs> like you have like real things going on right now and you are worried about me vlogging and blogging and I'm just forever grateful um for my family and their support like they know how much I want this how much I want to um just grow my brand grow all of this and it there's nothing like having support from uh, the people who see the behind the scenes because there's only so much that you all know and that's because I choose not to um, just talk about some things because it's really touchy and I'm like, I'm not crying on the internet, <laughs> but um, it, it means so much to me. There are so many days when I do not feel like I can show up that I don't have the mental or emotional space to, to do so. And, um, you know, I, I just think about like my brother He's called me and said, we're at chemo and Ma is trying to, you know, figure out how to play your video. And, you know, when I come upstairs in the morning, Ma is watching you on Instagram. She, she's like trying to find your vlogs and your numbers are going up like you are doing your thing. I'm so proud of you. Like you have kids, a husband. You have like a whole lot going You're on. doing it like you're following your dreams. And I'm so proud of you. My sister, who is like not my target market at all, <laughs> called to tell me how proud she was. And it's like that support in addition to like the love you all have been showing, like it, it gets me choked up. It really so does. I, um, you all are amazing. I thank you all for just joining me because, because I feel like I'm not living up to what I want to do. Like there's so much, again, if you're a new mezzanine, I have several degrees, but one of my degrees is in fashion design with a minor in art history. I was a textile designer in Istanbul, Turkey. Like I have a lot of experience and I'm, I'm not doing what it is that I want to do right now in its entirety because I do have so much going on. So there are times when it's like, oh, I want to, I'm going to go upstairs and record. I want to do this style video, this fashion video. But once I get the baby to sleep or if the husband has her, I need time for myself. Like I have to remember that, that I am still a person and there's only so much that I can do. You are watching this right now, mark my words year from now two years from now like you all are going to look back on this and be like wow like i remember when she started this like i employ you all if you are doing the best that you can do that's it do not beat yourself up just just be gentle with yourselves and i have to be gentle with myself so i um i'm getting ready i think i'm going to take juju the camera kid um to starbucks really quick because i need to do a return Shit. And I'm getting ready for a live tonight over on Insta. By the time you all see this, it will have already passed, but still join me over on Insta. And um, I thank you all so much. <laughs> Until the next vlog. Ciao for now.